NCTV 45, the train, anytime on your time. The Beanery Depot and Deli, coffee, made to order subs, snacks, and more. Meatball sandwiches, fresh and hot. Pepperoni rolls, fish sandwiches, chicken, milkshakes, the Beanery Deli. When you're hungry for something special, and it won't cost you a lot of beans. Peppers. Mouth-watering fruit. Fine dressings, apples, meats. This place looks so familiar. Everyone in Newcastle has to know about it. Yes, it reminds you of when you were growing up. Right in downtown Newcastle. Look at those fine lunch meats and ethnic foods. Yes, it's Joseph's. The Crane Room is a restaurant. The Crane Room is a bar. The Crane Room is a banquet facility. The restaurant will please you time after time with their diverse menu. Ask about their daily specials. See the menu at craneroom.com. The bar gives you an abundance of choices with 35 beers on tap and always changing. Their banquet services are always to perfection. The Crane Room, located at 3009 Wilmington Road in Ashanic Township. Call 724-656-1553. Now, Ashbet, do you know what time of year it is? I don't think you're paying attention. And, and, and now it's time to start getting serious. You, you, you know what? What time of the year is it? Let's see if Mr. Patrick knows. It's only one time of the year. It's football season. And now I get serious. You think we're just going to carry the crock pot around? Hey, come on. It's football. It's time to get serious about what's going on. Time to change the game plan a little bit. And what we're going to do? Well, I'm going to tell you. We're going to make an artichoke pizza. Yeah, that's right, Paul. No sitting there saying, oh, that's fancy food and I don't know if I can eat it. You'll eat it. You'll love it. I mean, you you got to be able to go inside them, outside them, around them, and up through them. And with this artichoke pizza, this is a sure hit. It'll be sailing over the fence. And see, here's what's great about it. It's versatile. You're not locked into the game plan. It can be cold if you're taking it on the road. It can be hot. If you're taken out of the oven and you're watching the game on NCTV 45. Hey, that's like passing and throwing on the same down and scoring. Now, wait till you see this. Right after these sponsors, I'm going to give you the can't lose game plan. Today's programming is brought to you by NCTV 45 and NC Radio 450, Newcastle's community television station. The Cedars Restaurant in Newcastle wants you to indulge in the food from their pleasing menu. The Cedars features Mediterranean, pub food, Middle Eastern cuisine, and so much more. They're open every day, 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. Call the Cedars on the east side at 827 Addis Street, Newcastle, 724-658-9543. That's 724-658-9543. We're back, and now I'm going to talk about the crust. Yeah, how to make a nice, simple pizza crust. 
Now, I already made bread in a crock pot. Now, I don't want to delay a game penalty, so pay attention. You're going to get one package of dry yeast and two teaspoons of sugar. The sugar is going to activate the yeast to make it raise so you don't got paste. And now you're going to use water, but it can be scalding hot water, about 110 degrees, and you probably want to use a cup. Now, depending on how big of a eaters you have, now you use a quarter cup. I like don't like to use that much. I use some olive oil, and um, three to four cups of flour. Now you're going to mix that together. Now be, make sure you don't burn the yeast. And the sugar is important because it activates the yeast so that it raises. And make sure you dust your table real well. Now I use a pinch of salt when I'm putting this together. Don't overdo it. Keep it simple. Let it raise okay and have some cornmeal there now they're calling me they're probably changing the game plan so i'm going to be right back after these messages hello folks angelo parada for ferone brothers wow you have to try their food great italian food and two locations on the south side on mill street and on Wilmington Road in Newcastle. For Rome Brothers, for pepperoni rolls, pizza, any Italian dish that you can imagine. Okay, and a whole lot more. It's For Rome Brothers. Stop by, they have those daily specials, and they look forward to seeing you. Tell them NCTV45 sent you. If you're craving pizza and more, then Little Johnny's 2 wants you to come through the door. Their menu includes many pizza varieties, jumbo wings, hoagies, calzones, strombolis, flatbread sandwiches, bread bowl salads, soups, and more. Dine in, take out, or have them delivered. Little Johnny's 2 can even cater your next party. Their prices are right, and the food is the way you expect it. Little Johnny's 2 is located at 130 East Washington Street in downtown Newcastle. Call 724-657-2210. Welcome back down. See, I had to talk to the coaches up in the booth. That's why the phone was ringing. They're all wondering, hey, he changed the game plan on us. Well, you're right. You got to be a little unpredictable and ready to strike, as they say, at the place. Just saying. Now, what else are you going to have to do? Well, now you got your pizza shells. Now you're going to have to make your artichoke dip. Now there's all these variations of what you can do. Some people like to use a creamy ranch dressing. Some people, but you know what? There's no shortcuts to success. You got to be ready to do what you got to do. Now we made an artichoke chicken here. And we made artichoke pizza before. Now, this is a creamy artichoke pizza, so it's a little different, but you can go back and take a look. We melted some butter, some olive oil, some chicken stock. We had heavy cream, some minced onions, garlic, and, of course, the star of the show, the artichokes. Now, as we got it to be thick, as you'll see in the picture, because I can't get a delay a game here. You know, I only got so long to explain this to you. As we got it to mix and we chilled it after we got it nice and thick. That way it doesn't go running all over your pizza like, geez, oh man. So it has to have some proper consistency. We used some Parmesan cheese and some Romano cheese in that artichoke. And then... We topped with a, now I like hot peppers, hot pepper seeds. Hey, you know, I'm not going to tell you what to do. Some people like black pepper. You know, just as long as you score, it doesn't matter. 
And then we put some mozzarella on the top. Wow. Where do you see this? We're going to go in and actually show you exactly how it cooked up. Now, don't fumble the ball. You got to hold on to it. I mean, look at this. This is professional stuff. We're going to take this break and we'll be right back. Tuscany Square Restaurant, 3470 Wilmington Road, where old world charm meets the modern conveniences of today. Spacious seating and amenities await. Fresh ingredients that make that just right pizza or entree. It's Tuscany Square for your next event. Stop and see us or give us a call at 724-654-0365. Now, I talked about our simple dough recipe to make our pizza shells. Here's uh, one of them. We have uh, cooked it so that you can put it in the freezer and then use them as need be. We're going to take our simple artichoke recipe and cover the top with the artichoke. And this dip can be cold or hot. We're going to make ours hot. Now, um, there's our artichoke, our, our basic artichoke dip, and what we're going to do is we're going to heat this at around 350 for about 15 minutes, depending on your size of the oven, and what, then we're going to top it with cheese. Watch when it comes out how bubbly good this is going to look. Today's programming is brought to you by NCTV 45 and NC Radio 450, Newcastle's community television station. Now, as you can see, we sprinkled it with some mozzarella and a little bit of Parmesan. We're going to let it just melt, and then we'll have the paste de resistance. But that's French. This is Italian. Later, before we stick this in the oven, flavored with a little hot pepper, some garlic powder, and uh, Parmesan cheese. Well, Romano. We use Romano here. And there you go. Our nice, hot artichoke pizza with mozzarella, just a tinge, and some Romano cheese. Oh, man, this is great. Come dine with us, come dine, come dine today. If you could use some real good food, there's a place not far away. If you could use a drink or two, or a place to go and play, come to Gallo's Italian Villa today. Welcome back, and you notice I'm still holding on to the ball. Yes, that's because that artichoke pizza, I told you, it's versatile. You get a cold day, artichoke pizza's good cold. You get a warm day, you're sitting at home in the air conditioning eating hot artichoke pizza. Who's going to argue with this? You could take it on a tailgate party a picnic, okay, or you could take it to the game. Or better yet, you can watch NCTV 45, and we put on many games, play a rerun, and that's a reason for you to make some artichoke pizza. Now, this is Angelo Parada for Cooking a Castle, and it's like I said, you're going to love it. <laughs>